1999. Grew up in a small town. Not much to do other than biking, and the step up from biking was four wheel drive, so decided to build it. To me, island spec would mean a small, maneuverable rig. It doesn't need to have a lot of power, but it needs to get into some tight areas and uh, not too expensive. So this started off as a rotten frame uh, 99 Tacoma. Um, I originally got it to redo the frame and then I was just going to sell it. Um, and after about a month of redoing the frame, I decided that I wanted to keep it and build it. So it is a 3.4 liter, 5 speed, nothing really special with the drive line. Um, starting with the front, uh, it's just a custom bumper that I built myself. Um, just a small little light bar and two pods from Speed Demon Lights. Uh, Runva 11 uh, winch does the trick. It's been great so far. It comes with a wireless remote. Um, everything under the truck has been done by me. I designed a nice cross member at Northwest Fab when I was working there. Um, it holds my rear up front leaves. They do the trick. They're nice and soft. Uh, Dana 44 front axle. I have uh, Cromali outers but just stock inners that are cut down for the size of this axle. Uh, it's a 79 Ford F-150 Dana 44, so it is a high pinion. Um, and it was being narrowed by the previous owner. It just happened to fit this truck perfectly. The gearing is 488s front and rear. I have a spool in the front and a nice little Miller locker in the rear. This was a Toyota IFS steering box. And then onto that, I went with a Sky Off-Road um, pitman arm and then I decided to build some one ton steering so EMF uh, rod ends there and all that tubing and all that was done by myself so these are Northwest Fab uh, fully billet steering arms and onto that we're just stock Dana 44 brakes they seem to do fine for now And we have 37 by 12 and a half R17 pit bull rockers, and they're mounted on some Eagle USA 17 inch aluminum alloy wheels. Decided to do a nice little custom paint job on them. Custom built sliders. Came and built them with a kick out. Not really that happy with them right now, but they do the trick. I'll probably change them up at some point. Yeah, massive kick out. <laughs> Helps get the ass out around. So for the rear we have Chevy 63's, uh, it's just a three pack and then the helper is just cut down. Um, seems to be really good for flex, I get tuck the wheel right in the wheel well, seems to work. I'm running some 12 inch Bilstein 5125's. All the shackles were custom built, uh, I Frenched them into the frame into the front. Decided to do a nice little side exit exhaust so it's all stainless high cut TIG welded. Oh yeah. And then triangulated shocks with the lifted mounting in, in the middle. Another custom built rear bumper. Um, decided to cut off the bottom of the box making a nice little high clearance one. Um, underneath we have the reverse lights mounted on an aluminum panel. Keeps them nice and tucked out of the way so I don't have to balance them off anything in the trails.
right, guys, that wraps it up for this Island Spec episode. I want to thank you so much for watching. Please hit that like button and subscribe if you aren't already. It really helps the channel out. We're hoping to grow a lot uh, before the end of the year. So smash that subscribe button and we'll see you in the next one.